I said for so long that I built a home. They tap at the windows and think they were bones. Lay hands on the bricks and I'd swear from inside I could feel it. Now here you are with your mallet and light. Damn, I didn't know you were a criminal mastermind, Miss Caulfield. <laughs> There's a lot you don't know about me. <laughs> Truly, is nothing easy? How do we get around that? <sighs> I'm not despairing yet. Let me take a look. Oh, yeah. Easy peasy. Sure about this? Positive. <laughs> Wait for it. Go! about descending into the mouth of hell. So glad you told me about this place. It's incredible. Ew. That's one word for it. Uh, I had a friend in undergrad who was obsessed with this building. She never broke in, though. She clearly wasn't as crazy as you. <laughs> Urban exploration is kind of my thing. I can't see a busted old place and simply not go into it. What is it about empty spaces? Places like this have been declared useless. I like finding the worth in them. I'm highlighting it. Doesn't useless mean worthless? I don't think so. Hell yeah, let's hit the bar. Not a bad shot. Oh, let me just... Don't! What? I don't usually rearrange the space if I can help it. I want it to look exactly like it would without human interference. Got it. Hands off. Is there anything that I should be doing? Just sit still and look pretty. The job I was born for. (laughs) (laughs) 
So what are we looking for exactly? Besides photographing random detritus. Most of the shoots I do, I find a focus. Something to hang the rest of the series on. I'll know when I see it. Something lonely. The loneliest thing you can find. <laughs> gotcha, boss. <laughs> Oof, try not to breathe too deep. This place looks like it's 90% asbestos. Ah, uh, yes. A br Oof. Hey, partner in grime. Come check this out. I'm glad Sophie's having fun. Hate to bring an unappreciative audience to a trespassing. Looks almost like a face. How old did you say this place was? I think it was built in the 60s, but it only closed down like a decade ago. Really? <laughs> it looks like it's been abandoned for half a century. <laughs> Maybe the tackier something is, the faster the rate of decay. <laughs> then wouldn't that jacket be totally decayed by now? <gasps> mean! This is Couture. smiling about nothing I'd like to meet the artist especially if this is a self portrait Ready to pledge yourself to the Prince of Lies? <laughs> you never know what's out there. Shit worse than goat heads, at least. Won't hear me argue. I've seen my fair share of shit that can't be explained. God, I haven't been bowling. Maybe if I just ignore this. Nothing will pop out of it. Weird kid. Maybe if I just ignore this, nothing will pop out of it. Fun party, though. There was an ice cream cake. Guess these haven't been greased in a minute. Wow. It looks so much cleaner than it did online. Are there photos? Yeah. The old website is still up. I wonder who's paying the hosting fees. Someone who loves kitsch. And dust. Figured out what your focus is gonna be yet? Not yet, but I'll know it when I see it. Good thing this building isn't on campus. My mom would definitely have had it raised to the ground by now. That would suck. Something doesn't have to be useful to be worth preserving. Well, you know my mom. She can't stand a charity case. The 
told you this place was the portal to hell. Behold, a devil. Aw, it's cute. I think it looks like an off-brand M&M. Yeah? I think it looks like Mr. Peanut on meth. And I hate it. I wonder if there's any way to get it out of here. What? You mean steal it? It's not like anybody is going to miss it. Couldn't you steal something that doesn't feast on the tears of orphan children? <laughs> well, it doesn't even matter. It's way too big to drag out with just the two of us. Don't ever talk to me or my sons again. Aw, oh, hey, my very own Mr. Peanut on meth. Life, I could never resist a deal. My money's on one half full Bic lighter to win it all. Oh man, I'm nine years late for my free slice of za. I've never bowled anything above a 180. Way to go, Doug. Oh, oh Doug, no. Behold, everyone for sale, bowling shoes, extremely worn. Shoes? Are shoes lonely? Super lonely, sans feet. Shoes were the subject of the first photo of mine your mom ever saw. Oh my god. This year's Caledon University artist in residence sent my mom foot pics? <laughs> Excuse you? Do you really think I'm the kind of girl who would just send foot pics to anyone? It's always the quiet ones, Max. Always. <laughs> it was a shot of a messy closet in a condemned house. Someone left behind all their shoes. Your mom loved it. Hypocritical of her considering she never liked it when my closet was messy, but... Figured out what your focus is gonna be yet? Not yet, but I'll know it when I see it. They must have thought something was worth preserving back when they closed this place down. So much for never rearranging a space. Damn. I bet that was stunning when it caught the light. Oh shit. That's it, huh? Hmm? The centerpiece you wanted, right? The loneliest thing in here or whatever. It was made to be beautiful. And now no one ever looks at it. Until today. <laughs> Something like that. Not in love with this angle, though. There. Help me find a way up. You got it, boss. I value my ankles. 
Looks like someone has used this to get around those stairs. You okay? Damn. <laughs> yeah, I I'm fine. That could have been bad. See, this is why you need an assistant. In case you break your ass and need an ass ambulance. <laughs> Go get your shot. Let me figure out how to get you back down. Armed and ready. Let's find that shot. How are your parkour skills? Um, any other options? Other? Yes. Better? I'll keep looking. Ain't no rule that says a carousel horse can't bowl. I wish I could do my eyeliner like that. And my hair. The gnomes smoking weed really pull the place together. I'm guessing that's the right room. That's the second biggest monkey DJ I've ever seen. Pretty shitty leaving these around for someone else to find. Are you here because I took one of your children? Have I unlocked some foul curse? Always wondered what's inside a bowling ball. Turns out it's just more bowling ball. Wonder if the birthday room was any less terrifying back in its heyday. Yes, this is the angle I need. Wow. Ballet service too? This place is bougie. Please remember to tip your ladder driver. Did you get your shot? And let's get the hell out of this death trap. Uh, you sure this thing's safe? Nope. nope. Come on, I'm starving. This loneliness makes me want a sandwich. Ooh. Beautiful dismount. Check this out, it's perfect. Oh, show me the angle. Oh my God. What? Are you okay? <laughs> oh. 
I need a drink. Do you need a drink? You read my mind. Uh, turtle? Turtle. My powers might not last. That's okay. We will. Chloe! Mac. Mac. You dead? Oh, yeah. I mean, I mean, no. Not dead. Just thinking. Hmm. Cosmopolitan for Max. Vodka shot for Safi. Very on brand in both cases. Perfect. Thanks a ton, Amanda. Hey. You look really good today. You think so? I switched shampoos. Oh. Not sure about it yet. So, what are you up to later? <laughs> if there's a just and loving God, sleep. Today has been a doozy. Ah. Well, sweet dreams. You know she was flirting with you, right? What? Huh? Amanda, are you actually this oblivious? Okay, hold the phone. I know when someone is flirting. It just takes me a while to decide if I want to flirt back. Didn't you go on a multi-year cross-country road trip? Did you get laid even once? Safi? Is this about the blue-haired girl whose picture you keep in your wallet? Wait, you snooped in my wallet? Stop deflecting. The girl with the blue hair. What's the deal with you two? Look, we were kind of high school sweethearts, okay? High school breakup turned you to Miss Havisham? It was a little more complicated than... Can, can we change the subject now? No, come on! You never talk about yourself. Would it kill you to open up the teeny tiniest bit? What happened? I mean, we were together for kind of a long time after high school. And then we weren't. She wanted to live in the future. I was too hung up on the past. That's all you're getting. For now. <laughs> Forever. <laughs> now change the damn subject. Deal. Amanda. Thoughts? Uh, fine, yes. I have a big, stupid crush on a hot girl. So does half a lake. Amanda's a total catch. Half of Lakeport doesn't have what you have. A Safi. I can help you navigate the complicated waters of love. First step, talk to her. About what? What do normal people even talk about? Mostly gas prices. But we're aiming a little bit higher. I mean, go look around. She's responsible for half the decor in this place. Learn what she likes. Yeah. Yeah. Why the hell not, you know? Okay then. Oh. Time to go be normal. All I 
have to do is find